I was Jack. Horror. After 10 years, you moved to your brother. At first, everything was fine. But things got worse and worse. Warning, this game contains a lot of noise and jump scares, blah, blah, blah. If you don't like that, then you get it. Now, yes, this is an adaptation of the creepypasta from, like, the old internet or something like that, you know? Um, the, um, Eyeless Jack. Yeah, inspired by Eyeless, Eyeless Jack from Tao Dev. I don't exactly really know that much about Eyeless Jack. I only saw, you know, pictures of the creepypasta. That's really about it. So, you know, yeah, let me search it up real quick. All right, hold on. Okay. Jack Nyra's better known as Eyeless Jack, is the titu 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 titular ma main antagonist of the creepypasta of the same name. He is a uh, um, eni um, enic enigmatic um, stalker and killer who breaks into the who breaks into the protagonist's home to torment and steal from them. Um, appearance. Eyeless, Eyeless Jack is usually described as a person in a black hoodie and an expressionless blue mask with no nose or mouth. Um, bl black liquid and a mixture of blood and tar is dripping from the eye socks behind the mask. His his fingers are sharpened into claws and his mouth filled with sharp teeth. Jack is 19 years old and 5'11". Damn. Um, he, is also, he also has gray hair, um, formerly Caucasian, um, and brown and... Eyeless Jack is infamous for being able to successfully remove a victim's kidney while they are asleep and sew up the wound flawlessly. So it uh, is apparent that he has an anatom anatomical um, and perhaps even medical knowledge. He also possesses tremendous stealth and is also ne almost never caught in act. Despite having no eyes, Jack can still see. He is incredibly strong, being able to maul Mitch before easily killing his brother. The full extent of Jack's power is still an unknown. The fuck? Alright then, um, on June 7, 2010, um, the photograph of Eyeless Jack was posted on 4chan by a user named Aaron. Um, the title of the post was Nightmare Fuel, um, which contained images of disturbing creatures from video games. One of these images featuring the original photo of Jack. The story itself was written on February 25, 2012 by a Wikia user SL5000, also known on YouTube as Papa Pinch. On November 21st, 2014, the story was um, officially terminated from Creepypasta because the writer requested it to be taken down for thinking that um, since Jeff the Killer was removed, Alex Jack should be removed by him before the admins decide what happened to it. On February 17, um, 2020, on the replies of Trevor Henderson's um, Eilish Jack tweet, user named um, Catchit, um, Pirate Cashew or something, revealed that he that he is the actual creator of the image of Eilish Jack for Prove It. He posted unblurred original image of Eilish Jack on Twitter. Also, according to him, he was he was sent blurred version of um, Eilish Jack to his friend because he didn't like un unblurred vision. Hmm. Well, that's something. Well, yeah, I actually did try to play this before and stuff, you know, um, and, yeah, the, before it even got popular in the first place, and, yeah, for some reason, something was wrong with the teleportation and stuff, you know, so, uh, I just kind of waited it out and stuff, you know, and, yeah, it looks like since the game got more popular and stuff, you know, they kind of fixed, you know, the teleportation issues on the console, or probably on all devices, I don't know. But, yeah, anyways, whatever ado, let's play the Roblox adaptation of the creepy pasta, Eyeless Jack. All right, here we are. <clears throat> um, Eyeless Jack. Yeah, it's another one of those Roblox horror games where at first, like, yeah, where at first it kind of, you know, it, it was kind of, you know, not really well known and stuff, you know? And then, like, like a few months later and stuff, you know, it just all of a sudden got popular and stuff, you know? Like, lots of people were playing it and stuff, you know? So, yeah, the usual. Anyway, so, yeah, let's join this. Yep, our volume's all the way up, you know, for the best experience. So... Yeah, um, alright, let's get straight into it. Eyeless Jack, alright, here we go. Game, let's do this. Pretty sure the teleportation works now, yep, alright. Let's do this. Here we go, is it recording? Yes, it is recording, thank god. Alright, here we go. Alright then. Yeah, I had, a, I had no idea about what it was. I was just laying down, and he was staring at me. Till now, I didn't believe in paranormal events, but now I am sure. 
he was the eyeless Jack. Uh oh, that doesn't sound good. Oh, would you look at that? All right, it kind of looks like a PS2 kind of you know graphics and stuff a little bit. Uh, this must be our brother. Yep, it, he. All right. Finally, we arrived. I haven't seen this place for ten years. Damn. Everything is literally a mess. I wonder where the key is. All right, Edwin. All right. Hello, Edwin Tugson. I really don't remember, but it must be around here. Yeah, since we're brothers, his last name has to be Tugson. Oh, where'd you go that? I already found the key. Yeah, do you? There we go. Entrance key. See? I already found the key. Let's go use it. All right, there we go. Nice. Talk to Edwin again. You found the key. Now, could you help me move the, these boxes inside? Okay, I will help you with the boxes. All right, then put all the boxes inside your room. Well, what, which, which doors exactly exactly lead to my room? No, this is the, this is the bathroom, aka laundry room. So one of these two might be my room. Is it? Yep, it's right here. All right, nice. Okie dokie then, alright, and of course, game passes have to be almost everywhere inside the damn game. Whatever, um, alright. I'm just gonna go grab this. Alright. Um, this is more tiring than I thought. Yeah, we have to do a lot of fucking walking. Oh yeah, of course, heh. <laughs> We have, we have stamina. And someone's not fucking helping me here, so... I, I, you, you can grab the box right right, right there. Oh, uh, uh, whatever, fine. Alright, there's one more box, so we're just gonna go and, go and grab it. I mean, Edwin's not even helping us at all. He could at least help, you know? I know it's only like four and stuff, but like, still, I could use some help here, especially since I have to do a lot of fucking walking. Alright, there we go. Nice. Finally. Alright, talk to Edwin. Alright then. Uh, okay, I guess he's just in his room. Never mind. Um, where the fuck did he go? Hello, Edwin? Ah, there you are. Thanks for your help. I couldn't move them without you. Y you didn't even fucking help in the first place. Uh, Alright, whatever. No problem. I'm here to help after all. Yeah, most of the time. Right. Wanna sit down? We can chat a little. <clears throat> Thanks, but I'm too tired after moving those boxes. Yeah, all by myself. I think I would drop off. Yeah, of course. Sleep well. Okay, then I guess we're... You're you're so tired. Go to your room and sleep. All right, then let's go to sleep. Yippee! Damn, two thirty a.m. Holy shit! All right then. Oh. Oh. Okay. Tell Edward about the sounds you heard last night. Um. I, I didn't hear anything. But whatever. Morning. Hope you had a nice rest. Well, I heard some noises at night. It was probably just a raccoon. Probably. There are a lot of raccoons these days. I mean, no shit. Like, have you heard of... Uh, whatever. Uh, you must be hungry. Uh, while I'll pre prepare br breakfast, can you scratch the leaves out? Okay, yeah. All right. Okay, and you're just making breakfast. At least you're doing something for once. All right, take the rake outside and scratch the leaves. Okie dokie. I uh, gotta just grab it. There we go. I guess the, the why the fuck is my phone phone? It's just a Discord notification. Um, all right, all right, boom, baby. Sure, what is the other person doing? What is this footprint? What? Oh. How, well, what'd you do that? How convenient. It leads to my room. Wow. How convenient. I wonder who that could be. Probably someone named Jack who's eyeless. What the fuck? Okay. 
just Toho or something, whatever, whatever it's called. Once again, I do not really watch anime that much, so. She's still here, but yet she's not exactly helping. Where's the, ah, of course, last pile. There we go. Tell Edwin about the footprint. We're probably just gonna say it's probably just nothing. Probably just going something in this little Sour Patch Kids. Brother, it, it's done. Though, I have seen a footprint outside. Thanks a lot. The footprint is not mine. Probably belongs to a raccoon. Yeah, yeah, ra- Okay, let's have our meal. Yeah, a raccoon's footprint that looks exactly like a human footprint. Can you put the laundry in the washing machine after dinner? It, it kind of smells bad. Okay, Edwin. Sorry for that. Uh, okay. Put the laundry- What? Is it really that fucking light already? Damn. How long have we been out there? Alright, where where's the... Is it this? Oh. Uh, okay, I guess it's just in our room then. Seriously, where the hell is the... And of course, I'm all alone again. Not fucking surprised. Um, Alright then, let's just go over here. There we go. Now, let's go put another pile. In here. That's what we're talking about, baby. Alright, nice. Again, again. I mean, they could at least, you know, be in the same room. Not all the way. Yep, you, you get it. For some reason, we can't still go into our brother's room. Also, if we share a room and stuff, you know, especially that bed. Okay. Um. Anyways. All right. There we go. Nice. What was that? I swear I hear fucking footsteps. Oh, it's probably just me. Talk to Edwin. It sure smells better now. I have one last thing to ask, brother. Go on. The walls are stained. If you can clean them up, I'd be grateful. You could at least help me and stuff, you know? Sure, I'll handle it. Yeah, you could just sit. Alright. Appreciate it. It's the last thing. Best of luck. Oh, okay. I don't know why you had to say all that, but okay. Clean the house, all right. Yeah, just using our fucking bare hands. Yeah, that definitely makes sense. Let's see, let's see, aha. Uh -huh. Is there something here that I missed? Yeah. Alright, there's one more. There's one more. Is that here? Where, where am I, what am I missing? Oh, of course. <laughs> Silly me. Alright, tell Edwin that you are going to sleep. Okie dokie. The walls are shining. You are free to do anything now. Uh, okay. Uh, Alright, master. I guess I will take a nap. I feel exhausted. However, you like to... Ha however you like to. Good night, brother. Okay, then I'm going to sleep. And so far, there's no sudden jump scares, you know, for the horror, horror trend, you know. Alright, it's 3.20 a.m. now. Oh, now we can move. Close the window. Okay. Check the noise from the kitchen. What was that? It came out of the kitchen. I should look. I mean, I can't really hear jack shit since, um... I kind of have the air conditioner on and stuff, you know. Uh, what? Why you sleep? 
Are you kidding? I guess I just take that flashlight and turn on the switch. Alright, is it... The switch has been blown out. Get a flashlight and turn on the switch. I guess it's outside. I suppose there's just... Ooh, gimme. Yay, nice. At least that cheered me up. I suppose there's going to be some jump scare as soon as I enter back in the house. Just turn my head just in case. See, what I tell you. Told ya. Told yourself, so, baby. I'm going to close this fucking door. Yep, what the, what the hell did I tell you? There was going to be a jump scare as soon as I entered the house. I'm not new to these type of games, especially the experience horror games where they obviously, you know, just give you sudden jump scares for, you know, for, for the scary, for the scariness, the spoopiness and stuff, you know? fuck was that noise? Morning, brother. What has happened to your face? What? Quick, look in the mirror. My eyes were removed. Were not, weren't any. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's not good. Cheap willikers. Cheapers. Cheapers creepers. Rut row. Swanks. Jinkies. It looks like you are sleepwalking. I can't find any other explanation for this. This is weird. Though we have a more serious problem. I don't know how... I don't know how, but it seems that you have lost your, a kidney. Wh what? How, how can that happen? I don't know what, what has happened. My condolence. Whatever. Get some rest and take care of yourself. I'm real. I'm really real realizing that all these, all these characters really just have the chill face on. I don't know why. Just seems kind of funny. And I don't know what's with Eilish Jack and his fucking kidneys, kidney, you know, obsession. Like, did, did he lost his, his kidneys or trying to get his mom's kidneys back? I don't know. How did it go? He told me that I was sleepwalking makes no sense whatever you have to rest today if anything happens I'm always with you don't forget that and then he's gonna die the next night thank you Edwin always bro fist bump alright then I guess we're gonna and we still have our flashlight so it was we weren't sleepwalking we were not fucking sleepwalking it was actually real Oh. Hmm? Hmm? Hello? Uh, press? Okay. I guess he's sensitive to flashing lights then. Alright, then we're going straight to our brother. Brother. Oh, never mind. I guess we're just gonna fucking leave then. All right then. Suppose we run, huh? Where do I run? Oh shit! Good morning. Uh, okay. I have both good news and bad news for you. I lost another kidney. The good news is you only got away with some scratches. The bad news is your brother is lost. <laughs> Told ya. I am deeply sorry. Leave the hospital. What did I tell you? As soon as he said that, like, I will always be by your side. He's just gonna be fucking dead the next night. And what did I tell ya? Yeah, what did I tell ya? He died. He died. Go to the bedroom and take the bag. And let me get... Yep, he is gone. He is straight up gone. Okay, I'm gonna turn that off. Because that sounds like analog horror music. And I do not like fucking analog horror. Alright then, I'm just... Leave. That, that... So anyways, guys, that was Eilish Jack. Okay, but I guess we're just gonna... What 
is going on? And he has to scratch as well. What am I supposed to do now? Oh, uh, what? Escape the house. What? Okay, I guess we just have to escape the house. Huh. Alright then. Uh, Alright then, escape... Escape the house. Let me guess, we're just gonna fucking die. Either way, you know. Seriously, did the car really crash? I guess I... Okay. Alright, I do... I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't like this. If I see something jump at me, I swear to fuck. What's that noise? What the fuck is that noise? Shit. Alright, I'm just running for my fucking life, alright? Okay. I'm using all my remaining stamina. Fuck, 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 come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh shit, he's getting closer. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh no. Come on, please, for the love of God, run. Run. Gotta watch out for the fucking cars. Please burn alive. Please. Oh god, where am I going? I got it. Holy shit, I'm gonna die. 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 Sounds like he's so damn close, and yet he's not. I don't. I hate that. I hate when that happens. If only I had some company, like Ed the Demon Slayer or something, you know. Oh dear. We died. D was that it? Did, did, did we just fu straight up fucking died? Oh, canon ending! Oh, and it was all a dream. Uh oh no. Eilish Jack. Well, that was it. Eilish Jack. Yeah. It it was literally all a dream that 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 crazy plot twist. Like it like all the crazy stuff. It was all a dream. It was it was all just a silly little fucking dream, yeah. Very crazy. Oh, I yeah, that was Eyeless Jack, basically a Roblox adaptation of the creepy pasta with the same name, Eyeless Jack. And I to this day we still don't know what's his what's with him and it, and fucking kidneys. Like what? Why is he obsessed with kidneys? I don't exactly know, but yeah, I'm just gonna end the video right here. Um, yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching, and yeah, it looks like there's, uh, there, it, it has another one of those game passes where you really have to purchase, like, you either can have two wins, or to simply, you know, just pay, like, a lots of bobuck to, like, you know, get a different ending, you know? So yeah, that's a way to, you know, get money, I guess. I guess you're one of the developers of this game, but okay. Anyway, <clears throat> anyways, um, thank you guys for watching. Um, if you wanted to play more Roblox horror games like these and stuff, you know, um, you know, that are either like adaptations of actual creepy pastas or just you know original horror games, something, something like that. Or if you want to know if I mean, just update one of these horror, Roblox horror games I did play before, I never heard the update, like a new chapter or something like that. Then suggest them on the group on our Roblox group, the Pugbiz YT group. You can click on the link has a very own paragraph. Or you can just do a long way search on Roblox, Roblox groups, the Puggy, Puggy Buzz YT group, and it's most of the first one to pop up. And here's the thing about the Roblox group, though. Yeah, just does more than Roblox games and stuff. Like, he's just Puggy's favorite shorts, extra ideas, holiday specials ideas, videos being derived on YouTube, like movie trailers, friendly fucking mods. Like, it doesn't have to be Roblox games specifically, it leads you to anything. Just make sure it's not appropriate for obvious reasons. Also, quick notes, though. If the Roblox team that you just is not Xbox support normal, but they'll basically just send the Google Ads on Xbox support. For, but when those be, become Xbox support in the future, I'll most likely hope remember to play it. Also, the Justice Gibby Toy related games are not allowed, so the Justice Gibby Toy related game, then boom, you completely deleted, and that was the first one I'm going to exit from the group. Also, if you do show the world game, though, or know if I mean to update one of these Roblox games I did play for, but I never heard the update, and so we made a video about it, there are two things I have right now. Number one, I'm probably support all the Roblox gameplays and stuff because I, because I usually just one last, or number two, I'm probably to do something else, you know, like an animation or a completed project that I have real announced yet. But don't worry, the Roblox team that you see, that's what's really cool about me, yada yada, yada, 
to the current description below. Roblox profile by into the YouTube channel. Also, do not just be able to escape to make me people on the platform. I don't know good things and all like game fan, big games, like stories with no times. Your comment will be deleted. And as a warning, I just want to show you that kind of stuff. Also, do not just be able to R63 games. That one is some explanatory. You exit from the group without any warnings. Also, do not just be any cash grab games, you know, like like games that are made by Roblox developers solely for the purpose of making money and stuff, you know, like those, like, especially, you know, rip-offs of the original game, like Midnight Games, the Experience Horror Games, even those, the Badass Tycoons, yeah, you're coming deleted, and it's not a warning, I just want to play Roblox games that I actually feel like effort would actually put into it by the developers, you know, so yeah, anyways, thank you guys for watching, Puggy Boys YD is time right now, and I'll see you guys in the next video, and as always, peace out.